Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. My name is Johanna, and for those of you who are new here, welcome. And for those of you who are returning, welcome back. Now, I thought I was recording this whole time. It was about 11 minutes of gameplay, and then I looked down and I wasn't. It's a little frustrating, I'm, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> but what I'm doing is just looking through uh, the ATM in residential services because I broke my axe. What we're trying to accomplish this evening is finish the quest to start the Nook's Cranny uh, build. And we're just going to sign off. August 19th on Wednesday. I did film a video yesterday and I am going to put it up. Um, it isn't the best quality because I mean, I'm clearly having some issues. So one of today's issues was I thought I was recording the audio when apparently I wasn't. Well, not apparently. I, I wasn't. And then today I thought I was recording the video and I looked down and it wasn't there. But I do want to keep, let's see, documentation. But I do want to document the journey that I'm doing. Um, and so even though the audio quality is not where I'd like it to be, um, just from that perspective, it, it makes sense to me. I want to thank you guys for your patience. had done and thought I had captured on camera was we finished farming for the rocks and so we've got a stack of 30 iron nuggets which is good and now we're trying to get up our count for our wood harvest but in the middle of chopping one of the trees changes by way of trees, by way of planting anything, because uh, I really just want to get the buildings and level up that way and then move once that is more of a thing. When I was on my original island, um, I don't know if, if I was aware of how the flow goes, and so I had decorated for the first two villagers and it looked really cute. And I realized we were going to do more villagers, and then I had to find space for that, and I hadn't unlocked terraforming yet. And so I, I think that turned out really cute. But then as we got more and more villagers, it seemed like I was just doubling and tripling the same tasks and moving things again and again. So I think for now, what my game plan will be is to just get all of the villagers, progress as far as we can with the island is, but then definitely do more cleanup than I've been doing, and then go from there. Alright, so while we are near that one, we've got that one, we are very low on the softwood. So, we are going to continue <laughs> to go and shake the tree. I didn't hit all of the rocks, nor will I, because I don't need any more materials at this point. And the 
because it is rather neat. You do want to just focus on this task. I did buy an extra axe, and just in case this one breaks, then I'll have that so I don't have to stop. I don't know if I've mentioned it once in a million times, but I'd really like to get this particular quest done and or started. If you are new to either my channel, welcome, um, or if you're new to Animal Crossing, or just new to Animal Crossing videos in general, the reason I'm shaking the tree with the net is that some of these can have wasps in them, and so if you have a net, you can actually catch it so that you don't get stung. And it doesn't, it's not like Mario where you lose a life or anything, but the first time you get stung, it swells in your eyes shut. And then the second time you get stung, because there's up to three trees that have the wasps, um, it'll actually send you back to your house. I really just don't want to run back all this way. That's, that's really how it does. I did watch a video once, I think it was either Danny G here on YouTube or Lauren Plays, where she showed, <laughs> it, I mean it was, it wasn't funny, but it was actually hilarious, but she got stung three times in a row, and so, yeah, because of stuff like that, I'm like, oh, okay, well, <laughs> I don't, I don't want that to happen, if just because it's messes with the flow of the game. Now just by the coloring of the wood, I can see that we are actually still rather low on the soft wood. The soft wood is this more yellow one, you can't really see it. The wood that has the darker brown with the yellow inside, that's just regular. And then of course the hard wood is the darker wood. So that right there is a soft wood, and that's what we're running low on. And it's funny because in my original island, um, softwood and hardwood was really easy to form. It was always just regular wood that you didn't get as much. I just assumed that's how it was, but it, it might be just dependent upon the island. Is this new? Yes, yes it is. Very good. Okay, so we're gonna bolt across. Now, only the hardwood trees have wasps in them, at least to my understanding. Um, the fruit trees do not, so I shouldn't have to shake them. But all trees, including fruit trees, pine trees, hardwood trees, and coconut trees, can give you wood. I'm better at targeting picked up all those beads. I mean, it's not a bad thing, it's just it's a bit cool. And I've mentioned this, or I think I mentioned this in the video I did yesterday that didn't actually have the audio. Oh. <laughs> and that's why we carry the net. Uh, swap it, yes. And we're swapping it because we can always pick up the music there, but um, that wasp is worth like 5,000 bells, so it's certainly not going to release it. Let me drop something else I can pick up in just a minute. So we're going to get the other fossil. <laughs> I should be covering the holes, but last time I looked, the villagers were in their houses, so it's okay. And I did look at my original island, and yes, once you upgrade to get the art gallery, the facade changes just a little. 
All right, so we're going to be efficient with our time. We're going to assess all of these because we do have that one bug that's also new. Okay, so we're going to make a donation and it'll highlight everything that we can donate. Oh, so one of them wasn't new. And because we're not giving him a single bug, even though he doesn't like the bugs, um, it doesn't gross him out. Okay, let's, let's look at this. So we've got two of these. the trees, I believe. Okay, and that's it for now. I'm kind of curious what this journey thing is. One of the first mammals and one of the few to live along the side of the dinosaurs. In order to hide from much larger dinosaurs, it was less than four inches long and quite unobtrusive. Some people theorize that these mammals were nocturnal until the dinosaurs went extinct. And they finally managed to live among those behemoths. They were nocturnal before it was cool. My feathers, I can't help but get carried away when fossils are up for discussion. If I but had the bells, I would purchase this fossil for myself. Unless I do not, unless I shall have to content myself with gazing upon it in this moment. I do thank you for sharing it with me. Oh, no, that's it. I guess to bug him, we could ask him about those bugs, but we're not going to. That freed up some space, at least a little. So I'm going to pick up that, pick up that. And of course, I don't remember what trees I shook. Where are we? Oh, we only need two more. Okay. No, I don't need. I <laughs> just got done telling you guys. I don't need the. Um, the net for that. But that's a new one. Yes. I caught a spider. A spider first. <laughs> oh, goodness. Why do they just have a whole team of people who just come up with those things? Those won't stack any higher. Yeah, I think we have enough room. Now, some of my favorite furniture on in the game is the, the wood log one. So I am gonna look forward to getting more recipes.
This is new with the summer update. The thing there that looks like a pulsating leaf. Now normally that would mean a furniture item if it fell out of the tree. But this actually is a pretty cool bug. Yes, a walking leaf. It seems to be <laughs> taking a step. to blathers in a little while. Go talk to this guy about building a shop. I'd like to donate. Yes, I did. A white painted wood, orange camel flooring. That doesn't sound very cute. <laughs> I'm in making this happen to pick out the perfect location. Why am I the one doing the work? <laughs> with the theme of just keeping things off to the side. And this is a movable house, or this is a movable building, I should say. Oh, thank you. Let's talk to you. Let's talk. This weather really gets the muscle glistening squirt. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> well, we're here. We might as well talk to her name. Yo, thanks for stopping by. Let's chat. Thank you. Hey, good. You can come over now, sweetie. There's nothing in there. You have more stuff than I do. Look, and we talked to my villains rooms, and I think after three or four chats, um, I can actually start giving them gifts. <laughs> for sure. Let's go talk to the lathers. And if we settle for the shop, then it'll actually be built tomorrow. Alright, so we're going to donate some things. And yeah, that one was new, and that one was new, and because there's two, then he won't get grossed out. Nope, thank you. Have a good evening. see the secret beach at the top there it's not actually very secret because it's you can see it from the level um, some islands you can't see it at all because it's behind cliffs um, but eventually red will be there but I think he'll show up on island first yeah, I don't remember how all this works because we did have Gulliver those two different times but I haven't seen any of their NPCs. 
So those are just um, random characters who visit your island, and they usually do things. I mean, maybe because we didn't explore parts of the island. That's a big shadow. That might be one of those interesting fish. Oh, why am I so bad at this? <laughs> Do you see it, fishy? See, look at it, fishy. Okay, let's, let's, let's get closer. Okay. disappointed in the fish. I'm not gonna lie. That might be Nemo again. We're gonna we're gonna let it be. I don't think any of the beach area is big enough. a mosquito. Oh, so now we get that one. <laughs> I think we might see if we can make something while we unload some of the material in residential services. And maybe they'll have another quest for us. what he gave us and that. We're going to keep those, those, those. Um, I'm going to sell that, sell that, sell that. Sell the fruit, we don't need those. That's probably horrible. I'm tempted to sell that, but I actually want to look at it first. Yeah. <laughs> 
<laughs> and we didn't sell our resources, so I know we can make something. So let's see what we can make. Okay, so we're gonna make this. I'm gonna make two of these. Put some seeds in And we'll just make as many of these as we can. If we were to drop it, that's bigger than the thing we actually just looked at. <laughs> it's kind of hilarious to me. So, we're going to go put this as a decoration. Oh, and I really should be looking at the trees. You look so angry that you sound horrible.
<laughs> that really would not be prudent. But let's see some of the stuff they gave us. Alright, so I'll turn the lights on. And this is the floor. That's horrible. Alright, well, that's going to go in storage. White painted wood wall. Oh, that doesn't look that bad. And then for the macrame, let's see. We put that there. And we do that there. And. Oh, that's really pretty. I'm actually going to do it on. I mean, you can't actually see it if you do it that way. So let's move this. I don't really need it to see what time it is. And then let's put this over the bed. And we're going to put this in storage, storage, storage. Over here and then go back into our storage and get that. We don't really need this light, but I like turning off the lights. And that just looks a little nicer than it was. And oh, we can put that. Put that over here. And what else do we have? Well, it definitely doesn't go in the house, but for right now it's okay. We don't actually have a lot of options. We're gonna put that on top now. Make that a little feature. Actually, maybe it'll look better at the foot of the bed. Yeah, I think that looks pretty nice. We do have this song by KK. And I don't believe you can register them on these. until we do get a proper radio. And because we have music, I, I don't care. Um, we're gonna hang this on the wall. Oh, actually, I'm gonna move that. I like it just for the artwork. Let's hang that a little higher. And let's move the shirt to over here and make it sort of a feature. Again, we don't have a lot of decoration, so it's not that big of a deal. Although these windows do not have blinds. The other ones did. I think they did. And so if we look in the mirror, what we can do can position it right because we can change what we look like sort of I mean we get back to this so oh there's more hair was there always this much hair that's cute Oh, I like the gray. Let's do that. It's kind of cute. All right, so let's dim the lights, and that turns into a little bit of a night light. And 
And I think, guys, we're going to call it an evening. So it's definitely the shortest one I've done so far. Um, be on the lookout for episode three. This is episode four of The Real Island. Just a real casual play. Um, and I'd love to know your thoughts and your feedback. I hope you guys have a great evening. And from my island to yours, aloha.